what's up guys it's brother shield here um today we're gonna do another video which was also um requested by um mercy email and no men carl men carl email men carl email if i pronounce that right he always says first in my videos uh which is awesome i think <laughs> um this was one of the games he requested and uh we're gonna play tekken 5 um the good thing is i was able to get into the menu but um yes wait for this yeah the good thing is i was able to get into the main menu and stuff but um um i, have, I was unable to get in game so um i just wanted to quickly show you um how the game runs how the cutscenes run on the show tv so um yeah without further ado let's just jump right into it so um there is quite a list of games that um you guys have um sent to me on by youtube I actually got confused when I first saw this, you know. I haven't played Tekken 5 though. I mean, I'm controlling this thing as well. Thing. I'm controlling this thing as well. <laughs> thing. Uh, man. Big Shack. Okay, um. Just says press start button. I was just wondering why was this. But this was well. But either way, whatever short game that was, it was running like, like perfect 60 frames per second. Almost perfect 60. So that was like a very classical game. A uh, nice little cutscene here. But well, those running at 30 frames per second. A lot of glitches and the lines in the middle. A lot of black. Uh, these look like Jin's feathers. Hold on. I'm being honest I think the first thing they really need to fix is all the cutscene uh, personally and the audio as well during the cutscene I think that's the number one thing they should focus on for gameplay because that's gonna take a while um, before that hits full speed there may be some games that are able to run full speed but I think those are like there's like a very very small library of them even um just threw him there yeah so again the cutscene on this game is running at roughly around 30 frames per second at least um the videoed cutscene pre-rendered sorry pre-rendered Hachi okay
Come on. Like Dante. <laughs> that guy just looked like Dante. Some reason. Reminded me of him. What's the name we be riding a bike on a rooftop? Jeez. Ah. Yeah, that's right. Look like a badass. Okay. My first time actually watching this cutscene, if I'm being honest. I haven't played Tekken 5. Okay, that was the intro. Let's start and let's get in. So, medium. Okay, have a story. The King of Iron Fist Tournament 5. Okay, so as you can see, it's now getting speeding up a bit. Main menu tends to run a lot faster compared to um, video and some of the pre rendered footage. So, we're getting like a 59 in the menu around. So. I'm going for Jin. Jin Kazama, a child of destiny. So in this cutscene, we gain a lot faster um, frame rate. An evil spirit welled up within Jin. Awakened by an unknown voice, Jin looked around at a forest completely destroyed, and he knew he was the one who did it. Jin was plagued by nightmares, triggering the devil gene. If this keeps eating away at me, I don't know how long I can hold on, says Jin. 
Jin sets out on a journey to end this evil, with destiny as his only guide. Get yeah. ready for the next battle. So, those cutscenes um, it tends to work out a lot um, better compared to the pre-rendered cutscenes. And uh, here's where the problem lies, guys. Once it's time to get into the actual gameplay or do some actual fighting, it doesn't tend to work. I mean, I'm pretty much stuck on this black logo, black um, well, this pretty much black screen here. So um, yeah, I pretty much showed the video because that's pretty much all I could show. Really, if I'm being honest, and uh, also the little boss scene of Jin right there, or any of the other characters. So, guys, um, I'm gonna end the video right here. Unfortunately, I'm I'm unable to continue from this point on. I can get into the menu. I we can watch some of the cutscenes, but we can't get in game for some reason. Uh, so um, until this um, until the emulator's been updated a few times, um, oh, I'll try and come back. I'll try and see if I can come back to Tekken Five. So um yes yeah, as, as I said earlier this um game was requested by Mancia email um doing this one for y'all doing this for you and uh yeah guys let me know what you think of um just running um the speed uh were you impressed with the speed were you not and also if you guys have any other suggestions of um any other games that you want to see running on a shield tablet please let me know again if it if the game is unable to go into or if the emulator is unable to boot into the game or at least run it um, I would just pretty much reply saying I won't. Um, I'm unable to get into the game, and I'll pretty much just um, well, move on because there's quite a there's quite a list. So anyway, guys, let me know what you think in the comments below, and uh, if you like this video, hit that subscribe button, and as always, I'll see you on the next video. Have a good one.